Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Argentina against Brazil. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. Okay. The Argentina first team. Well, it looks as though they're lining up fairly defensively with a back five. But I think the wing-backs will have license to get forward at every opportunity. And also watch out for one of the central midfield players going to join the front two. The starting 11 for Brazil. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. Lucas Paqueta starts with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the striker is the very creative and eye-catching Richarlison. And the contest begins. Rafinha. Now Eder Militao. And he read it well defensively. Rodrigo de Paul. Oh, he looks threatening. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Lionel Messi's daredevil style of attacking could well make the difference here, Stuart. I would describe him as majestic when he's playing at his best. He glides past defenders, he's got that ability to run with the ball into open space, he can pick out a pass, he can wriggle out of tight situations. He's the most creative player on the field today. He's protecting it effectively. Lionel Messi... Well, they keep working away, looking for passing lanes. A deft clearance. Vinicius Junior. Well, not giving the opposition a look in. That's strong play. Oh, but they've lost it now. Well, the keeper wanted to take it cleanly and did. Well, they've lost possession of the ball. Molina. Messi. And a chance for them to nudge in front. Oh, terrific save. Well, you're absolutely right. That's a top-class save. Just look how he reacts. taken short Messi can they forge ahead and it's come off the keeper and relief as the keeper holds on well he reacts so quickly doesn't he that's a great bit of work from him Danilo Neymar 
The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. And there it is! Living history! The opening goal of the 2022 World Cup Final. Incredible celebrations! Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Neymar. It's a splendid through ball from Neymar. Credit to them for winning back possession. Paqueta. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. A good effective pressure high up the pitch. Marcos Acuna. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Rafinha. Wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. And Neymar. On to Casimiro, breaking at pace. De Paul. Firing it in, and that's a straightforward stop. Neymar. Not a huge chunk of added time, one minute. And Neymar. On to Paqueta. And blocked for now. A chance then for the respective managers to... So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. an interesting pass well I must say it did look so promising but the flag is raised offside the verdict Stuart well he's just too eager there it's the right run but he's made it too early Casemiro now with Paqueta I must say this looks promising Richarlison, magnificent defending. Messi. Here's Alvarez. Lisandro Martinez. A fine use of the ball. Getting forward. Superbly read and executed. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Vinicius Junior. Can he finish? Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, really stout defending there. Off the line. It's one corner after another.
And he's fired over the corner. Firing it towards goal. Tremendous block. Marquinhos. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Lisandro Martinez. Di Maria now. De Paul. Molina. And space to cross it. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Well, they get themselves level here. And it's still on for him. Oh, a goal! He's equalised! Was he made for moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. So back underway. They've levelled it at 1-1 here. Richarlison and he takes it on and saved by the keeper well you can't argue with those stats can you they've had good chances at both ends the game is being played with great intensity can't miss surely well the keeper has outdone himself wonderful save time for a change then He's driven in the corner. And a no-nonsense clearance. Oh, he's gone for goal. And using his body to good effect. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Marcos Acuna. And a goal at this stage could be decisive. Messi. Oh, a good diving save. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. They favoured a short one here. Struggling to get it away. Martinez, magnificent defending. Now can they counter clinically? Vinicius. And the snuffing out of the cross there. Danilo and a goal at this stage might well turn out to be decisive but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end Otamendi well that's it for the 90 minutes but this is not over and two 15 minute periods of extra time to come So away they go again, the first period of extra time, and it's legitimate to ask to what extent mental strength will come into this. Looking forward to it. Delightful pass. Vinicius Jr. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Teammates available. Just cutting off the supply. Fabinho... 
back with Casimiro. Richarlison! And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Lionel Messi. It's with Martinez. Textbook closing down. And now they're on the attack. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. Anthony. He has time to play it over. Fabinho. Well, getting in the way. Superb save. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. Half-time in extra time. And still, they are level. And so, 15 more minutes. We're into the second period of extra time here. Otamendi. De Paul. It's with Paredes. Lisandro Martinez. Tension building, still level. Martinez. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Gonzalo Montiel. The ball with Martinez. Romero. Time is fast running out. Five minutes left in the second period of extra time here. A very timely interception. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Neymar. Can they forge ahead? Blocked it brilliantly. Richarlison. Oh, a goal! And how important could that be? Maybe it's a story of one hand on the trophy at this stage of the final. A huge moment. Well underway again. It's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. And the referee brings this final to an end for the first time in 20 years. Brazil are world champions once more. Well, no surprise there, Derek. Brazil have been brilliant and they fully deserve this trophy. Brazil, the world champions. And this triumph, you just feel, Stuart, is going to be fondly remembered by all Brazilians. You're absolutely right. They've played some great football. They've been inspiring. There's been some great individual performances. It's been outstanding from them.